and I'm Madison with your morning announcements. Today is Friday, September 15th, 2023. Today is a day one. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is the last day to claim your clay. Stop by Mr. H's room if you have a clay sculpture from last year and you would like to take it home. Please remember the expectation for the hallway is that your cell phone and AirPods should be away. Please walk, do not run to your next period class and stay to the right. September 15th begins Hispanic Heritage Month. This month, please tribute to the generations of Hispanic Americans who have positively influenced and enriched our nation and society. Let's learn about some influential people. Buenos dias, Springton Lake. This is Senora Diaz with our opening announcement for National Hispanic Heritage Month of 2023. Hispanic Heritage Month is a celebration that takes place in the United States each year from September 15th through October 15th. During this time, we recognize the positive impact that the Hispanic and Latinx American communities have had on our own country. This celebration began in 1968 when President Lyndon B. Johnson first introduced it as a week-long celebration. In 1989, the week was extended to become a full month. This year's theme is Latinos, Driving Prosperity, Power, and Progress in America. To celebrate this theme, we've collected a series of inspirational figures to share with you. Today's figure is Lori Hernandez. Lori Hernandez is an artistic gymnast for the Team USA. She won gold and silver medals in the 2016 Olympics. Thank you for listening, Springton Lake. Enjoy the rest of your day. Let's check in with Dr. Sal for the answer for Trivia Tuesday and the Friday Funny. Hey Spartans, it's Dr. Sal coming your way today. Happy Friday. I hope that you're all doing well. I hope that you've had a great second week of school and that things are going really well as you transition to the new school year. Uh, we continue to have a, a great start to the year. I hope that your first advisory session on Thursday went well and that you enjoyed connecting with your advisory group and also with your advisor for the year. We have lots of great things planned for you. Uh, in addition to some activities and lessons, we also have some uh, fun projects that we'll be doing. Uh, hopefully our annual pumpkin decorating contest, our gingerbread uh, decorating contest in uh, December, but lots of things throughout the year for you and your advisory to do together as you form another group and another connection with a group of students and an adult here at school. So things, as I said, continue to go well. Uh, really appreciate people meeting expectations, uh, keeping their cell phones off and away. Things are going well in the cafeteria at lunchtime. In fact, I'd like to shout out two grade levels who have done an exceptional job so far at lunch in the cafeteria are really consistently meeting expectations. We'd like to reward you with something extra special for today. Uh, for Friday. So shout out to grade six and to grade eight for doing a really great job in the cafeteria, getting quiet when uh, you're being asked to do so, uh, making sure that those cell phones are off and away, cleaning up after yourselves and responding to redirection. We appreciate it. Uh, and so we have sharing with you in your Schoology lunch course, a very quick one question survey uh, that asks, uh, you pick your incentive for today, your reward. Uh, you can either have some extra minutes outside for recess today, or we'll play some music in the cafeteria for you today. So you get to choose your reward, take a minute, go into the Schoology lunch course, complete the quick survey, and that way you tell us what you want at lunch. Seventh grade, you can do it. We need you to kind of step it up next week so that we can again reward everyone next week and we'll continue to adjust and come up with maybe some other things that we can do to recognize you for doing a great job and meeting the expectations. So thank you. Now looking ahead to next week, we have our annual club and activity fair that is happening next Friday, one week from today. Uh, you'll get to sample and, and find out about all the different clubs and activities that we have here going. And you'll also get to learn the title for this year's All School Musical. All that is happening next Friday, Club and Activity Fair. I'm sure that we're gonna be hearing about that over the course of next week. So as we wrap things up on a Friday, I have the answer for this week's Trivia Tuesday question. This week's question, I asked you, what is a group of stingrays that are swimming together? What is that group called? And it was a multiple choice question. The correct answer is a fever. Yes, a fever of stingrays. 
And so congratulations to the following students who submitted a correct answer. We randomly selected your name and we'll be adding some bonus Spartan Bucks to your live school account. Congratulations go out to Melanie Linton, Adriana Bailey, Tristan Wright, Micah Kaliagas, Maya Jancic, Jackson Nunez, Hudson Godwin, Sebu Flett, James O'Brien, and Colin Marino. Now, Trivia Tuesday will be back again next week, and we'll also be bringing back another popular activity, and that is the Wordle Wednesday, another chance for you to test your skills and potentially win some bonus Spartan Bucks. So that's happening next week as well. And now because it is Friday, it is time for everyone's favorite Spartan Scoop segment, the Friday Funny. So let's see, what do you I, I have for you today? So did you all hear about the poor guy that got fired this week from working in the calendar factory? Yeah, apparently he took a day off and it didn't go over real well. <laughs> so my son said to me this week, he said, Dad, hey, can you tell me, what is a solar eclipse? And I said, no sun. You get it? No sun. Yeah. So I was really confused this week. I'm sitting in my office and all of a sudden music starts coming out of the printer in my office. Crazy, right? Yeah. Apparently the paper just started jamming. All right, everyone. I hope you have an awesome weekend. For those of you celebrating Rosh Hashanah this weekend, I hope that you have an awesome holiday. Enjoy the time with your family. To everyone, whatever you do this weekend, have fun, stay safe, relax, and get ready for another great week. Have a great day, everyone.